Hello everybody, my name is Myla and welcome back to my channel. Today we ignore the fact that my hair is being demented, oh my god. Today I have a gremlin. Say hi. Hello. Today we are doing a Shein maternity try on haul as you do. Um, I don't know if I actually uploaded it or not, I can't remember, but I have already done one of these technically. Again, don't know whether I uploaded it. But I am in my third trimester now. I have got a heckin' bump. She, you can't even really tell with my dress on, but trust me. There's a child. She is there. It is a heckin' bump, okay? So, we're getting into the bit where I kind of am starting to need maternity clothes a little bit more. Uh, as opposed to just big, normal clothes. Because, of course as great as that is um it's big everywhere and the rest of me is not big the rest of me is still normal sized so that's where the maternity clothing comes into it we did a cheeky little shein shop didn't we you did i just paid for it yeah that's how it works ladies um yeah and half of it well not even half of it some of it has arrived i will then do the rest of this video when the rest of it arrives but I'm going to show you guys what I've got and try it on and see how good we think it is. So there are four items, I think, in this first batch. I have already opened it and had everything out just to check to see what actually arrived. Um, now, keep in mind, I am buying for the summer um, or for as it starts getting warmer is what I'm buying for. But also I am buying clothing keeping in mind the fact that i'm having a c-section and i'm gonna have to deal with that both well before but also getting clothes that are going to be nice and easy to wear afterwards because your bump doesn't disappear overnight ladies she stays for a while to say hello so yeah here i have three bits of normal clothing and pajamas so i'm gonna start with the um like nightwear these little Shein bags, by the way, I'm keeping hold of all of them to use for packing my hospital bag so that everything is like in one place. And I can just be like, yo, babe, can you grab me out my underwear? And it will be in the bag that's labelled underwear. So first thing that's rocked up is a nightdress, which he is not going to like. I'm already telling you. When I felt this, when I got this out of the packet yesterday... I was like... Do I even know what half of this is? I don't know if you actually paid attention when I was showing you or not. But he straight up is not going to like the feeling of this nightshirt. I can really see it. It's, it's like paper thin. Yes, it's paper thin. But that's fine because it's hot in the maternity ward. And it gets hot in the UK. Anyways, this is the Thank first you. one. It is just a grey and white stripy one with buttons all the way down. So, you know... You can get your titties out nice and easy. Although saying that, it is there's like a nice big neckline here. And a little pocket, which you're not going to use for anything. That's more decoration. But yeah, it is paper thin. I am kind of questioning it. This is a... It's meant to be a size 10. So we'll see. Because here's the thing. With maternity clothing, you're not meant to buy up a size. You're meant to get your size. Let's get... Daddy's approval. Right. What's wrong with this? Daddy's verdict. Feel it. I just didn't think you'd like how it feels. No, it's not sweaty. <laughs> oh, okay. Anyway. It's stretchy. Let's see how it fits. Okay, now this, of course, is sleepwear. That looks nice. So I wouldn't be wearing tights. I'm not going to be wearing this out. Um, It's really soft. What we were. <laughs> um, it feels nice. Again, yeah, I don't know why you're saying I don't think it because it feels kind of sweaty. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Okay, anyway, I really I like really this. I don't understand what sweaty means. I really like this, it's really comfy. It looks nice, it's nice on baby for now. I mean, it has got some stretch, but the whole point is that we don't want anything tight. But it's going to be great for feeding and stuff because buttons which actually come undone so i will be able to easily breastfeed 
this next thing is a dress it's meant to be more of a nicer item let's be honest i'm not going to be going anywhere or doing anything where i need to look nice um did come with a spare button though so thank you Sheehan. love that uh-huh well they don't always come with spare like she and stuff doesn't come with spare buttons ever so yeah no this i don't know if i like the feeling of and i'm thinking it's not lined it's really really thin i'm thinking i might get um a few like bodycon um like vest like cami maternity dresses to go underneath some of these things so this is it it's a cute fabric but it's see-through it's entirely see-through because it's so thin and cheap and nasty you could see the windows through it it's so cheap and nasty that i think i need to get another dress to go underneath it um but it's kind of cute i don't know it looked better on the model hopefully it will look better on me because it kind of just looks a bit like a tea towel currently it just looks it just looks cheap and nasty and it feels cheap and nasty we'll see it's not as see-through as it looked once it's actually on like i can't you know my underwear is not showing or anything um it fits quite nice it's not really doing much for the donk donks you know there is cleavage don't know how i feel about that these are fake buttons so i don't know how i feel about the breastfeeding scenario in this dress it's not, it's not i mean it, it it's not there we go um the shoulders are kind of cute all i'm saying is this neckline is just a little bit awkward do you get what I mean? Yeah, I get what you mean. It's kind of just awkwardly placed. And like, I'm wearing a nursing bra, so I don't actually have proper cleavage. It's just kind of a bit of a mess. I kind of look like a frumpy granny. Do you get what I mean? Like, this dress just, just does just look a bit frumpy. I get you. Does it not? It looks a bit shit. Nope. Didn't think so. Okay, so the last two things are like, well, they're like the same item of clothing. So they're little play suits kind of things. These first one is more like overalls than a play suit that you would wear on its own. Like you'd have to wear a top under this, realistically. Um, eek. But it's really cute and nice and thin. It is just this khaki green like smock that's kind of like the fabric or how i would describe it it's just linen little like smock looking dungaree things like little shorts which is cute there's no like harsh waistline so i should be able to wear it straight out of surgery and you adjust the straps by tying them which i think is really cute so yeah that's just yeah just nice overall Shindigs. Bubba? Mm -hmm. Verdict? It looks like an apron that you'd wear in our GCSE. Nice. <laughs> Hear me out. Kind of love it. <laughs> Bump. Happy. They're not tight. I still have growing room in them nice and loose i would probably if i was actually about to go out i would probably tighten the straps because they are really 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 loose right so there we go now that i've like tightened them up a bit it looks a bit better already looks nice. bump has plenty of room of course this is one that will there's loads of room on the sides here like i'm not struggling with that but it doesn't i don't look fat like i still look kind of like i have a figure which is all good and nice the camel toe scenario is not not happening love that got pockets 
Love that. Does my ass look good? No. But it's fine. Cute. What do you think, babe? And then this last one. Oh, I just punched her. That was smart. I'm sorry. She don't care. She's taking that. The last one. I'm triggered. Mm. I'm triggered because this is probably my favourite item. Mm. But it didn't come in a proper Shein bag. It's come in a shitty single-use plastic bag. I'm like, for fuck's sake, Shein. Try harder. Um, so again, green. Like a little all-in-one. This one, you could get away with nothing underneath it. It's just really cute. It's just little green. It's got a fake tie. It's not actually a drawstring, but you would tie it. Um... The buttons are real. You can undo them for ease of um, feeding from the breast. The so this is really thin. Obviously, this bit unlined. The shorts unlined. Oh my god! Not actually putting time and effort into your cheap and nasty clothing. Never could never happen. Why would you put time and effort into your cheap and nasty clothing? It's almost like Half your clothing would not be as cheap and nasty if you put fucking liner in it. This is my favourite thing ever. I think this might actually become my favourite item of clothing ever. Um, for all my history girls out there, this looks like a pair of combinations. <laughs> like this fully looks like, a, especially because I have tights on underneath, this fully looks like a pair of combinations. Oh my god. Um... I love this and I have nothing else to say other than I 10 out of 10 recommend this from Shein. I love it. Oh my god, I'm crying. This is stunning. The little bow is just so cute. It fits so nicely. It's not tight at all. It's not sitting awkwardly. Like, everything's just sitting nice. There's no issues here with awkward cleavage or anything. Welcome back to part two. Whew. I mean, for you guys, it literally would have just gone like, but you know. Package number two has arrived. I have not looked at this one. I have had an absolute nightmare trying to get this. I have another package, which isn't Shein. Um, the nightmare trying to get these in my house has been whatever. <laughs> no. So let's try to open this. Oh, God. Eh. 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 This is going to be full like first reactions because I have not got a scooby what is actually in it should i just like pull them randomly out the bag so like we really don't know what's going on yeah let's do it okay <clears throat> don't know but it's in a sheen bag it's in a ziploc bag so i'm happy because we have run out already because we started packing our hospital bag so we ran out <clears throat> oh i know what this is okay Ugh. let's put that there so this, if I'm right, is a bit of tissue paper. No, this should be an all-in-one. Yes. Oh, that's so cute. Is that? Yeah. So this, again, it's really, really thin. You can see through it. I would, of course, wear a top underneath it. I would not wear this on its own. Um, but this is a little kind of play suit, I guess that's what they're called. This is so friggin' see-through. It's actually insane um <laughs> but then i do have really harsh lighting and the windows and we learned from last time that just because it looks see-through when you hold up to the light does not mean it's that see-through when you put it on it's not adjustable so i'm kind of concerned on that front because i have an itty bitty torso but i have got a doink doinks and a bump to hopefully fill it out but this should be really nice for both before and after she's here and it has two pockets i mean whether i'll actually end up using them or not is a different story <laughs> yes oh love that okay hear me out i didn't think i was gonna like it but i think because it's just it's a little bit more it's got a little bit more shaping than the other set of like overalls um i mean the short the pockets are cute and stuff it's quite nice and flattering everywhere of course it's really low in the back but i'm not complaining i would if i was wearing this out i would be wearing a top but of course for this little bit of video i can control what is seen and what is not seen 
so I'm not wearing one. Um, but yeah, I actually really like it. I quite like the cut, especially. It's quite nice and low. And yeah, I could definitely wear this if it was a bit of a cooler day, then I could wear a full top underneath it and it wouldn't make any difference. Or I could just wear like a bando or a little crop top underneath it again wouldn't make a difference to it it'd be nice and easy and still look good and yeah we said it was really see-through but i mean you can't see me underwear from or anything so okay it felt nice though like it doesn't feel cheap it's just thin this this has been in my shein wish list for so long like since I think like probably since before I even knew I was pregnant that I've had this item in my um, wish list just because I like really wanted it. It's so cute. So it's that same, already it's that same material as the nightshirt that you guys have already seen. That weird, really kind of thin paper bag almost material. This is a full nursing dress. It is a full on dress dress. Um, in the picture we were looking at it and me and my sister-in-law were saying oh like that's you could get away with wearing that out like there's no issue there no now that I have this in my hands I could not get away with wearing this out it is very clearly like it's got this really cute moon and they're like little eyelashes I guess like closed eye pattern looking at the front of this I know there's no titties in it right now I don't think I would be able to get away with wearing this out but of course the reason why it's so low like that is for breastfeeding throughout the night so i'm not going to complain about that being like low cut because it's just pajamas <laughs> this is so comfy oh my god i can't stand this dress i'm taking this to hospital with me 100 percent straight up like don't even come for me it's so much more loose i think because it's a little bit more fit and flare than the other um night shirts which are just like straight up straight down this has a nice like it's so much looser yes it has the shaping but it's not like tight constrictive shaping there is all this room in the front here which is perfect and it's also sitting like nicely like i'm not like exposed exposed the sleeves are nice they're not tight movement everything this is so comfortable this is 100 percent going to hospital with me for after she is born what's next who are you who are you I love this because I literally can't remember what I ordered because it was so long ago. What are you? You feel a bit nicer than some of the other stuff. Are you a dress? Probably. Oh, yes. It's this little dress. So it is literally just a little red straight up and down, like nothing fancy about it kind of dress. And then the titties move nicely so you can breastfeed while wearing it. Um... Yeah, it's just a maternity dress. It's nice and cute. We'll see how that goes. It's a really nice cotton, though. It's, it doesn't feel cheap like a lot of the other stuff that I have had from Shein. This is a little bit out of my comfort zone. Like, it's not really my style. But I was like, you know what? It's going to be hot. And I'm going to be very limited on what I can wear. So let's try and, like, branch out a bit. Why not? Funny, innit? I did not think I was going to like this, but I actually really like it. And I think because it's a heavier fabric, it kind of does, it gives you a bit more figure. It also kind of looks like um, one of the like base game nightwear dresses that is on The Sims 4. If you know, you know. <laughs> um, I actually really like this. I didn't think I was going to like this as much as I do. It's really comfy and simple and like, yeah, but where it is just like that nicer fabric, it's definitely a lot yeah with the boobs my only thing i would say about this is because i am of course very large chested so the elastic doesn't quite sit where i'd want it to but it's still really cute and i like have no complaints like this summer <laughs> so excited and little bump she's happy she's also been taking a nap this entire video and I'm kind of like, why? But then when I'm sitting down to edit and I need to try and concentrate, she'll wake up and start kicking the hell out of me. <laughs> but no, this is really cute. I love this. I can see myself wearing this a lot. It needs to get warm. Who are you? 
a tick, apparently. What's this? I don't even know. More tissue paper. Why is there so much tissue paper in this round? Oh, this is a little, uh, okay. This is another little um, all-in-one or like play suit. Um, it's just black. And again, it's this nice cottony feel as opposed to the cheap and nasty feel. So it has got little shorts at the bottom. And this has, again, the nice titty access for breastfeeding. But this has adjustable straps on it. So we should be good on that front. I should be able to make it tight enough where it fits me this could be very good this looks so good it's so comfy i think i would um i don't even know like maybe tighten yeah okay i have some room in these counties i'd probably tighten it and i mean it's nice easy access on that front this is so cute and it's so flattering and it's like not too short like my ass isn't hanging out and it's not too short in the front and i just this is really flattering and i will probably continue to wear this you know even like next summer and stuff and a little bump is so cute in this these little like play suit things are really going to become like my new favorite thing for summer i just need it to get warm now so that i can actually wear this stuff because i'm getting loads of summer stuff in preparation and like trying to pack the hospital bag and stuff but i'm just like i want to wear it <laughs> this i actually bought something yesterday in a print very very similar to this like while we were out <clears throat> So clearly I like this print, although it kind of reminds me of a um, Weatherspoons plate, almost. <laughs> like a nicer version of a Weatherspoons plate. It does not feel as nice as the one that I got yesterday. <laughs> but then the one I got yesterday cost a lot more, so you know. Uh, who are you? It is another little kind of slip dress. I can't work out what's the front and what's the back. wait no genuinely okay so there's extra seaming on this side so i think this is the front it's literally just a little slip that is it it's just a slip dress there's nothing going on there's no adjustable thing on the straps here so concerned instantly the first thing i want to do with this slip dress is this <laughs> I instantly want to do that and like stand like this and try and give myself a figure or try and have something going on with it because it's just hanging and doing nothing. There's just no shaping whatsoever. There's nothing like under the boobs to try and taper it in or anything like that. It's just, it's just there. I mean, if you were a bit more up and down or not as booby, you'd probably be fine. But for my personal taste, it's just, I wish it had more going on. You get me? This is not clothing, so I will leave it until the end to talk to talk to you guys about it. And then this is the is this the last thing? This is the last thing. Okay. Um this again has to this has to be more nightwear because I swear I ordered more than I have received. Yes, it's that exact same nasty paper bag feel it feels horrible when you just feel it with your hands but it's really really comfortable to wear as we found out when i tried it on the other day this one is a nursing one so it is actually double lined at the top yes queen we love that so this is black and white stripes like so and then it has this top layer here that you can pull up and then this bit where the lining is is where you get your titty out to breastfeed essentially okay it's not the most flattering thing in the world but it's pajamas so it doesn't actually matter it's comfy that's all that really matters it's nice to wear it's soft it's you know she's fine she's not being attacked or anything it's kind of just hanging and then this is surprisingly easy to lift up and down don't worry i'm wearing a bra it's just nude <laughs> Uh, but yeah, and of course this would fit differently because if I'm in bed, I'm not going to be wearing a bra. This final thing is a nursing cover. Um, so it didn't come in a sheet bag, but I'm not that surprised. It's a nursing cover. So basically what it is, is, oh my God, okay. It's a muzzy or a muslin cloth that has a metal why is it got, okay it's got a metal strip in the top i did not think it was gonna have a metal strip in the top what the hell 
wait a minute who are you so this like goes over like so and you feed it through here so now that i've done this i probably won't undo it this is the most important bit obviously is here so it's just like a cover to that can't fall because it's around your neck and then there's also a back strap so that you can put this through as well oh, i don't know how do you get in two to fit through here is the main issue with this anyway i don't think the second one really matters i think this one that goes over the top is the main thing because it's just going to stop this from falling so it will keep you know it'll keep it up and then you don't have to worry as much about accidentally slipping but you can still of course lift it up like this and see baby and check baby and i still have full access and stuff so yeah that's what this is oh. um they're not a breastfeeding essential you can just use a muzzy um my sister-in-law just used a muslin my mom just used a muslin um with me and stuff i just thought for a bit of peace of mind because i'm gonna probably be doing a lot of stuff alone for a bit of peace of mind that can't fall down so i don't have to worry about it cool so that's that and now i have to try and try now i have to try all of these clothes on oh god okay Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I hope you did enjoy. I'm trying to do a lot more vlog content at the moment while there's not really like any exciting things. Although I have got some ideas for some videos. Like I might try and do a pregnancy Q&A. So, you know, go follow me on Instagram if you want to be part of that. Because I'll probably do it through Instagram. Um, yeah. I'm trying to think of anything else. I think that's really it um of course there'll be more maternity and baby content coming if there's any non-maternity and or baby content you guys want please let me know i might be making some music soon but in reality probably not because i'm kind of busy <laughs> uh so yeah thank you guys for watching i hope you did enjoy give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you are new or haven't done so already because it's free so you know and you can unsubscribe at any time um all my social medias are linked down below including my tiktok please go follow me on tiktok i post over there a lot more than i post over here because it's a lot easier um and yeah that is the end of this vid yay editing i've already edited the first half so it shouldn't actually take me that long fingers crossed but yeah <laughs>